hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding url actions in auto version 14 so currently in the screen you are seeing auto version 14 community edition where we are continuing our auto 14 development tutorials so we already have learned about the window action also in the previous video we have learned about server actions in Odoo. so today in this video we will be discussing about the url actions so as the name suggests it's something related with url so what this type of action do is that it will redirect us to a particular url or the given url so the url action simply will redirect us to a given url so let's see how we can add a url action inside the om hospital module so if i go to the hospital and if i go to the appointments so what i'll do is that i'll simply add a button here inside the appointment header and on clicking that i'll show you how to redirect to a particular url so let's say add a button here in the header first so if i go to pycharm this is my custom irons path that dev folder and here i have the om hospital module and if we go to the views folder and if i open appointment view.xml file so here we have the header so this is the corresponding form view so what i'll do is that i'll copy an existing button from here and i'll put before the state field and i'll remove the id and i'll give the name as action action url simply i'll give the name as action url uh, and string as uh, i'll give the string as open url so what i'm doing is i'm simply defining a button where we can click and see how the url action works so i have defined a button of type object so button type object will call python function and the name of the button is action url string is given as open url now i have to define a function inside my module named action url so if i go to models folder here i have appointment.py file and this is the corresponding model so what i'll do is that i'll define a function here diff of action url now i have to define the url action inside this function so in order to define the function let me search for an example inside the odoo source code so this is my odoo source code and if i right click and if i find in path and just you can search act url so if you search act url inside your source code you can see a lot of sample the type is ir.actions.act url so you can see a lot of sample inside your source code so what i'll do i'll copy this code copy and i'll paste it inside our function return type ir.actions.act url target either you can give self or new i'll explain the use case of it and then you have to specify the url that you need to open so what i'll do is that i'll simply uh, give the url of our module in the odoo app store so you can see this is the module that we currently develop OM hospital and it's available in the odoo app store you can see the module is available in odoo app store simply you can come here and you can download so what i'll do i'll simply copy this url Control c and i'll put it here that is i need to redirect to this url https apps.odoo.com slash apps module 14.0 on hospital so what happens is right now if you click on this button you will be redirected to this app so let's restart the service as i have made change in python and let's upgrade the module and see what happens so i'll go to the apps menu and i'll upgrade the odoo 14 development tutorials so yet if you haven't got this module just simply download it from here so you can see the module has been upgraded now if i come back to the hospital so if i come back to hospital then to appointments and if i open any of the appointment you can see you have the button the newly added button called open url so let's see what happens if i click on that so if i click on that you can see i'm getting redirected to this stop module in the app store and if you click on back button you will be reached back to odoo and if i click on this button again you will be redirected to that url so right now you can see we are getting opened in the same page itself suppose you might have to open in a new tab 
so in order to open in new tab you have to change the target equal to new so once you give target equal to self it will be opening in the same form itself in order to open as a new tab you can simply put target new so let's restart the service and let's see the difference so i'll go back to browser and if i click on open url you can see it's getting opened in new tab so if i again click on that you can see another tab is getting opened so this is how simple you can add a url action in odoo simply you have to return type must be ir.actions.actURL target you can put either self or new then simply you have to specify the URL also this URL can be dynamically generated suppose what I can say um, suppose if I need to open any module like if right now we have hard codedly given the module name means URL here suppose if you need to get generated dynamically module name you can do like this on hospital I'm hospital I'll specify the module name here on hospital and you can put a percentage is here you can do like this I guess. let's see what happens suppose here I have specified the module name in a variable and here I have put a percentage s and have specified the module name here so let's see whether it works or not so let's go back to your browser and if I click on open URL you can see still it's get worked suppose right now in the code itself we have had coded the module name that is module name equal to OM hospital URL apps.com slash percentage is so this percentage is will get replaced by this variable that is on hospital so let's take an another case so let's see so what I'll do I'll specify the module name that I need to open here inside this field in the prescription field on hospital so the technical name of the field is so let me activate the debug mode so if I go back to settings and if I open the your debug mode so from here I'll activate the developer mode and if I come back to hospital then to the appointments and if I open the first appointment you can see the field name is fields dot the field name is prescription so I have entered the module name here inside the prescription tab so you can simply give like fields dot self dot prescription self dot prescription so let's restart the service so I have removed the variable that I have added and right now I'm taking the value name of the module from the prescription field where I have entered OM hospital I'll click on save and let me close the tabs that I have opened and right now if I click on open URL you can see the module is getting opened so right now OM hospital is getting open so let's take a case where we have to open this module that is ODU 14 accounting so I'll simply copy its technical name or URL that is OM account accountant I'll copy this and instead of on hospital if I put that and if I click on open URL you can see OM account accountant is getting opened so this is how you can generate dynamic URL that is instead of giving a hard coded URL you can simply put percentage s and then you can replace it with a variable and then open so this is how simple you can define an URL action in Odoo version 14 so that's it for this video if you have any doubts feedbacks or suggestions don't hesitate to comment it out directly under this video or you can reach us over the email that is odomates at gmail.com and feel free to connect us in the social medias like linkedin facebook and twitter so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you